ready. So here we are, are, everybody. And... We are talking about Chow Chow because we are heading back to the table with my good friend Chef Bud. We're going back to the tailgate. What? I've missed you, my friend. My it's friend so was to gone at a board meeting and then we had Labor Day. It seems as it's if it's very, been months it since has. we've and been together. We don't like together. separation, her and We I. don't. We don't. So anyways, what we're doing today is we're going to have some fun because we make this little dish we call Chow Chow, which is a great accompaniment for your uh, sausage. But today I'm using our Kelly's Baby Rope Sausage. You will love this little sausage. See how nice this is? Uh -huh. And you might know that I skewered it twice. Oh. Just for effect, you know, just so it looks nice. Uh -huh. And then we have some radicchio. And Not you can to be see that over here. With red cabbage. Yes, but it's really good charred. See how we're charring it Why there? is it really good charred? What is it about well, the radicchio and a Well, I think the cabbage in general, in general is good that way. And what mm -hmm. we've done with it, you know, because you kind of get all those flavors out of it and mm -hmm. kind of gets that nice mm -hmm. crunch to it. But um, what we've done is a little bit of the garlic roasted olive oil from Amarillo Grape and Olive, one of my favorites. A little bit of that, salt and pepper, that's all you got to do. Just on top of this. Yeah. So you skewer everything. Yeah. And what and do we do? We make sure that we soak the skewers. Yes, because okay. you don't want them to catch on fire, Yeah, friends. and then we just put these little uh, sweet peppers on there. Now, before we did that, you can look on the cutting board there, and we have like a charred onion there. It's a good look, you know? Yeah, so we took the onion, we cut it, a little bit of the same olive oil, put it on there, and we just let it grill, okay? Then what I've done is I've chopped that up. You've also, been very busy, by the yes, way. Also, with, well, there's lots to be done. Also with um, some jalapenos. Two jalapenos that I charred, then I cleaned, took the uh, membrane out of, because that's where the heat's the at. The inside. Yeah. Okay. Okay. And we did that. And then what we did is we've got a third or a quarter of a cup of uh, apple cider vinegar. We've got uh, some brown sugar. We've got some deli mustard, or Dijon mustard, I'm In sorry. this pot. Yes. We're making and a then, sauce. Yes. And then a coarse, a coarse uh, mustard. Oh, okay. so two kinds of, yes. oh, so a yellow yes. and then, and then oh, a coarse, and, then I'll, and you can use like a whole grain mustard if you want. I just really I like, like that. Yeah, I really like that yeah. there too. Okay, so you can see, can you see folks at home? Mm -hmm. Can you see on Facebook Live? Yes, okay. we see. Now, one of the key ingredients is coming up, okay? This is the chow chow? Yes. Oh, okay. It's going to chow chow down. Wait till you eat this. You're going to love it. Terrific. This. So it's got to cook down, you see. But what we're going to do is just a little turmeric, okay? Not turmeric. Do you know that turmeric. that's really good to help you um, after you've had a little too much to drink? No, I didn't know that. Yep. Are yep. you telling me like I should know that? I'm just telling you. Okay, we're going to put that in there. The and more it, you know. Do you know the flavor of this? Do mm. you have any idea? No, I don't really. I can't identify that. Kind of a curry, kind of a curry peppery taste. Okay. But here's the key to this, mm. okay? It smells if nice. You will, if, you, <laughs> if you will look, you can see how these are starting to cook down uh -huh. in this sauce. Oh my gosh. What we're really kind of doing is caramelizing, okay? So then, one thing I want to point out to everyone is I was trying to find these cool little, these cool little fork skewers. Mm -hmm. They have these skewers that are kind of like a fork. That would work oh. really good for these. So we didn't have those, so I just did my own thing. But anyways, uh, I like to double them up like this because I think it's a good look. Okay. Mm -hmm. And if you'll just go with a sweet pepper and then cut your mini sausage up, and you could uh, the mini sauce, the mini rope, I think is important because it's a nice little piece. Look at how nice that cooks up like that. And okay. it probably cooks a little bit quicker. Yeah, it cooks quicker, but I really like to put it on with the peppers because what we're going for is all this stuff to kind of cook down, all right? Mm -hmm. If you'll pour some of this olive oil into one of these uh, bowl like this or a platter, you just kind of coat everything and uh, go. This is, like I said, this is our Kelly sausage from Benny Keith. We, this is a new line for us. They've got all kinds of sausages. We love this product. It's brand new, and we're so excited to be making a recipe with it. Well, terrific. We're going to let it cook, and we'll come back. And we'll, we'll have some chat things. Some yes, things and the chow chow. Don't forget the chow chow. Don't forget the chow chow. It's essential. Chow chow.